Hello, ladies and gentlemen, it's Mike here at Game from Scratch with a public service announcement of sorts. So a while back, all of the Quixel Omega Skins assets were made available on Fab for free. By the way, if you have not done this already, go and get them. Go to fab.com. You will notice this thing over here. Get all Mixel scans, uh, Quixel Mix Mega Scans for free. Claim now. Click that, and they will all be added to your account. But... And it gets a little bit more complicated than that, unfortunately, because the rollout of Fab has not been flawless. By the way, you only have until the end of 2024 to claim all 17,000 free assets. But once you've claimed them, they are yours to keep forever. The problem is the legacy stuff, such as the Quixel Mega Scans archive over here, uh, and more importantly, Quixel Bridge, well, they don't actually work with this new collection. So what they've done is they've made it so that you can now claim them on Quixel as well. And I'm going to show you how to do that today. So we got this new announcement, uh, and I told you I would update when this actually came out. So if you already have the 17,000 free assets off Fab, you still want to do this. You're basically getting another license for them in the legacy format. So this is especially important if you use them with, say, Blender, Godot, uh, basically anything other than Unreal Engine, because you can use Bridge or Mega Scans to access them and do a lot more with it. So you'll see we now have this update. You can now claim the entire legacy mega scans library with just one click to get started head on over to the quixel mega scans library or grab the latest version of bridge and click claim now in the banner that appears to start the process so we're going to go through the process right now so here we are this is the quixel uh, website it's available you go to um, mega scans and then click on so if we go back over here click on the mega scans over here and it will bring you to this you can also do this by going into bridge to grab the assets that way all right so once you're here make sure you are logged in and then click the claim now button and it says you can claim legacy mega scans for free on bridge and quixel until december 31st 2024 you are uh you will be able to download and continue to use them under the epic content license claim and claim and done they are now yours so now we're going to do is fire up quixel bridge and so which basically is uh kind of identical to ooh, what was that about uh allow that oh there's an update Okay, maybe I do need to update that. So I'm going to pause. I'll do the update. All right, so here we are on the updated version of the Bridge app. Now, I'm going to make the assumption that the update was just to give you the ability to go ahead and claim them. So really, if you've already got Bridge installed, fire up Bridge. It will tell you there's an update available. Go ahead, install the update. Uh, and then what you're going to find is my assets. So now you'll see before my purchased was 50 items. Now my purchased is 18,870. And again, these are mine for ever and again you only have until the end of the year but then you can keep using these forever now they're going to keep quixel bridge uh this application uh around until uh they've got a suitable replacement so until fab can actually do everything that quixel bridge can do this is going to stick around so what you can see here is you can actually export this out uh to a variety of different formats so go ahead and all right that's a great demo uh fail to download let's try with a different asset go ahead download that I don't know what's going on there. That's the power of live demonstrations. Things don't work. All right, so there we go. So what you see is that you've got the asset downloaded to your machine like I just did with that one. You can then export it out. So I only have Blender and I have a Blender plugin available for it, uh, but you can actually come up and configure a variety of different uh, options. So over here, uh, your settings are there. And then the other part there is your manage plugins. And you can see you've got plugins available. So I actually haven't got the Blender plugin uh, installed in Blender and configured. That's why you're getting that error there. But you see there's Unreal Engine, 3D Studios Max, Maya, Unity, Houdini, Cinema 4D, Clarice, and uh, Marmoset plugins available for exporting out from Bridge. And none of that functionality exists today for Fab. So until it's replicated, it seems like Bridge is going to stick around. Uh, so you can claim directly in Bridge or just head on over again uh, to Quixel Mega Scans website. I'll sign into your account and then claim all the assets. What you're going to have then is that you will own all of the assets here on Mega Scans, but you'll also own them uh, on your Fab account. You're going to have to go through two separate processes, so grab it and claim it there as well. So here I went ahead and logged back in. You're going to see that for me, it's already been claimed. So that was it, ladies and gentlemen, my PSA. The stuff is available via a one-click process. It is in two spots, both on Fab. You're going to want to get Fab because that's the way all this stuff is going to be supported going forward. But you're also going to want to get it on the Quixel Megascan slash Bridge side of things because that is the legacy version, and that is the version that plays best with other systems. So you can grab both of these collections you have until the end of this year. And you can get, once again, a huge selection of 3D assets, 3D scans, textures, and materials 
materials, all AAA quality stuff, uh, and you, you really, really want to do this. If you haven't done this by January 1st, you're going to regret it in the future. So go ahead, claim both sets of free assets. It's the exact same stuff, at least for now. Going forward, it is the fab stuff that is going to get updates, but you're going to want to grab the Quixel Bridge side of things as well, and now it is available in a one-click claim process. So hopefully you found that useful. Let me know what you think. I will talk to you all later. Goodbye.